Oh! On the hair, dude? No, no. You can fix, you can touch up the makeup. The you can't go wash your hair. The hair? Oh, oh no. I'm very against having children at weddings. Welcome back, everybody. Wow. Dynamite intro. This is Lush. As always, crushing it. Honey, what is the one day that every woman wants to go just perfectly? The wedding. The wedding. Unfortunately, that's not always the case. So what we have here is the team has prepared some clips of weddings not going so well or something at a wedding that you might call a fail. Let's take a peek here. <laughs> and here comes the bride. Why was the... Wow. You think that... Like the dress rehearsal, like how many times have you opened that door and you couldn't be like, maybe we need a little grease on these wheels. Wow. Wow. The handle comes off. Thanks for playing. Skateboarding at the wedding. Okay. That is a, yeah. How, what did you think was going to happen, dude? Oh, oh, I seen that one. That's a classic. You ever seen that? Dude falls into, I think it's a pool in the back. I don't Yeah, think yeah, yeah. I think so. Possible that was from a skit or a show. I can't remember. Mm, doesn't look like it. <laughs> that's just funny. That's, that's just funny. yeah. That's cute. Whatever. Oh no! Don't fall down the oh, steps, oh, bro. Oh, oh. Don't rail slide, dude. What do you do? Fall over the back. Oh! I can't. Oh, he's all right. He's all right. Hold on. Hold on. I gotta see that one more time. Yeet! <laughs> You're dumb. That's just pathetic. Have a little balance, dude. What's wrong with you? Concussion. Good boy. What? What do you do? Did the dog like pee? Oh, yep. he pissed on her dress. <laughs> yep. What do you expect? That's bad. No, no. Oh, cheeks out, baby! Oh no! And then show. they went. No, it wasn't that. He. Cranked over the rock into the water, dude, with the wedding dress. That's probably like photos too, right? Right after. after oh, Grandpa, you forgot to push the seat in, dude. <laughs> Save the champagne, though. That was good. That's just oh. I saw one clip. I don't know if it's gonna be on this list of like the wicked drunk first man. They were doing like first the man? first man. God, the wicked drunk best man. They were about to do like the cake, like feed each other a piece, and the best man just comes out of nowhere and like picks the cake up and like smashes the bride in the face and like ruin their moment. Oh. And then the br and then the groom punched him in the face. Yes. Yeah, good. It was excellent. The little lad nearly ruined his own parents' wedding. Ooh. Oh. It's on a leaf pile, my guy. That was funny, though. Look at this dude. Came in hot. I mean, he's like two. <laughs> yeah. Kind of hilarious. You're like, why did he do that? Well, he's two. That's why I did it. I just realized when I got up to the end of the aisle that I'm missing half of my dress. <laughs> Maybe I could put it on now. Yeah. Where is it? <laughs> All right. It looks like a full dress. I'm not kidding. Two, two nights ago, I had a dream that I did this. That I, I walked on the aisle without it. <laughs> Here comes the Is it the veil? <laughs> it's the veil, yeah? No. It's like a train in the dress. Well, oh, that's what... Oh, that's... I'm sorry. That's what I meant. The veil, the veil, the veil is this, right? Yeah. Okay, I meant the train. It's probably just the train, right? I've never been to a wedding like this before. <laughs> oh, where she forgot the train? Like, oh no. I think. I don't know. You would have had it's... to pay me to figure out what was wrong with her dress. Like, uh, the train's only cool for the walk down the aisle anyway. So, like, yeah, and then yeah. usually you bustle it, but apparently hers comes apart. Well, time. wedding ruined. We're getting divorced. <laughs> you already walked down. I would have just left it alone. I mean, yeah. Point. Like, why even? It's like, oops. Like, who cares? The dress looks beautiful. No one would have known any different. I promise you 98% of the people there wouldn't have had a clue. I think 100%. But I paid all this money for it. I have to attach the train. Well, you messed up. That is an extravagant dress, dude. Holy <laughs> this is a cheap-ass looking chair, dude. Look at it. It, is. it looks like it's made out of, like, Toys R Us plastic. It's like the, a look. Like, kind of Really bride is the brides walking down too. Tough timing, man. <laughs> You've broken a few chairs in your time. Oh yeah, I can empathize with that. I've broken many a chair. First day as a wedding planner. Oh, oh. Oh, uh, this is one of those ones where I was, you know, they do the gym fails one, where someone just mm -hmm. literally films himself pretending like they're looking around and then uses yes. all the clips. It's kind of a genius way to 
I get it. Get views for other people's content. <laughs> How'd that feel? Uh oh. Oh, that was a hard fall. Oh, mom. Oh, mom, are you okay? Granny broke her hip. What? Okay. Please take that oh, off. Oh, no. Oh. oh, I thought she was going to get yanked back. Oh, that was cool, though. She's probably like a, she's, pro <laughs> she's probably an acrobat. It wasn't. He's just like it's just weird stuff. That's normal. Hmm. <gasps> I had to give. Uh -huh. <laughs> that's also, funny. that's like quite the dress, dude. Perfectly good Look. cake. My cake. No, that the whole point. It was a fake one that oh. they did. They, they pranked her. Look, it, it just bounced off the ground like it's not a real cake. See. <laughs> Prank. That's a lot of lights going on there. Looks like a. Is this the real cake? Yeah, yeah. No. Is it? Oh, yeah. I think so. Are they gonna prank it again? Like, she should know there. That, that cake is outrageous, dude. First of all, Indian weddings are the sh they go hard. We went to a wedding in Philly, and it was it was in a beautiful hotel. There was an Indian wedding, and they sh they literally shut down the f street, like in they the did. middle of the city, they did. and had like a chariot riding behind, I was and so people were like how they could shooting do that. confetti and like t-shirt cannons, like in the middle of a Philadelphia block. Like a DJ with the whole like <laughs> huge speaker system. Yeah, it was wild, man. Music kind of slaps too, if I'm being honest. Uh, yeah, yeah, we enjoyed that very much. Indian music was hitting. Seems the joke didn't land well. I feel like if there's ever a time to prank or do a joke on your wife, it's not at the altar. Like, let that be the one place. That's correct. Where there's a little bit of. I'm glad you know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just don't mess with brides in general. I'm down a little nervous. <laughs> <laughs> One girl in the audience. Oh, it's on the back of his vows. What? I'm kidding. It's a joke. It's a joke. Oh, is it? Like it's fine. Oh, ooh, like marriage. Oh no, like marriage is so oh, bad, and my wife. I go. Oh, I'm, I'm trapped. Cool jokes. Make them with your bros, but just not on the wedding day. You know what? So. That just tells a lot about his personality. He's probably terribly unfunny. <laughs> Right? Well, that girl in the audience didn't seem to think so. She was dying. Probably like his sister or it's something. Probably his mistress. <laughs> that guy uh, couldn't get a mistress if he tried. Yeah. <laughs> he barely got a wife right there. Yeah, barely. Yeah. She was probably very reluctant after that. Well, I don't know. Maybe he's a funny guy. Now nah, he's a turd. Just the timing is. <laughs> no, he's a turd. My wife's not. He's, he's a turd. Oh, oh no. Bro. The third girl's like. I'm very against having children at weddings. Oh, uh, if, dude, be unless... careful. Be careful, Mrs. Lush. You're going to get the internet. I mean, over. I don't give a shit. I'm not having another all wedding. Up in arms. I've seen takes recently that are like, weddings are supposed to be about family. It's crazy that you're not allowed I to bring kids. I guess so. Blah, blah, blah. It's just. I'm impartial, dude. I don't care. I think it would be. If you want to kids, it depends wedding, on the kind of wedding you're going to have, I guess. Sure. Don't um, expect something like that not to happen. That's what I'm saying. But like, I'm the type of person that would see that and I'd be like, oh, kids, stop it. Big deal. Like, the kids are a little cake. Kids being kids. Like, you but make the best out of those situations. But, have but a most brides would have an annual. Down. over that because they have this artificial expectation that a wedding needs to be the most perfect million dollar thing. Like, yeah, you well, want to have a nice time and have it be beautiful, but like you have to take it in stride if silly things like this happen. But yeah. I'm not like a big wedding person anyway, but if no. people want to put on this big elaborate event, it's going to be very risky to have there, little, there are little children like that around. More variables when you have kids, especially when like if you have a kid wedding, obviously a lot of the brides and grooms who are like involved and don't have the time to watch their kids the whole time, the kids are just going to run rampant. So yeah, totally understand if you don't want kids there. I'd probably enjoy a kid wedding too, but like I think if people request a kid-free wedding and you get mad about that, then you're just a loser. Like it's yes, their, it's exactly. their wedding; they can do what they want. You know what I'm saying? When I said I'm against having kids at the wedding, I mean like if the bride and groom don't say you can bring your kids, don't ask because they probably don't already, want them. If, if they haven't in made specifically it. invited them or said. It's a family thing. Understandably, like childcare can be tough. Not everyone has like family nearby that can take the kids so you can or go to the if wedding. Or a destination wedding or something. Like so that. that's where it gets tough, where it's like, oh, maybe it's one of your really good friends. You really want to see him get married, but you're really struggling with childcare. Sorry. I don't know. Skype I don't know. it, baby. I still probably wouldn't ask to bring my kid. We then one have, person has to go. We haven't had to worry about that in a while. So, <laughs> well, there you go. Yeah, then it's like, all right, and then maybe just the, the bride or the groom go, or this. Oh, bye bye. Looks like a very modest wedding. I like it. There's also another thing at weddings. That what is it, Mrs. Lush? Someone else trying to.
feel the spotlight and proposing. Oh. And they're like, oh, you know, weddings are all about love. It can make you feel a certain kind of way. You yeah. might be like, you know what? Our whole family's together, gonna propose, just because I'm gonna have everyone's attention at that point. But that is so wrong to steal someone else's day. Yeah, I would agree with that. We saw that somewhere. I don't know if it was our own life or we saw it online. I can't remember. But it's definitely the internet. It's definitely been a blend. <laughs> but I would agree with that. Yeah, probably picking someone else's wedding to propose. Unless it's like, there's some sort of dynamic where you're like brother and sister and like you guys have been together forever and it's like kind of plan. I don't know. Even so. Oh man. Oh, to catch on fire. I like that guy. That, you gotta at least try like it, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Morning, everyone. Cooked, sorry. What are you gonna do at that point? Just enjoy it while you can. You're gonna have to clean it up off the dance floor. Or the door opening fail. <laughs> just a random uncle showing up late to the wedding. Ta-da! I mean, at least they waited to do the smoke until he was through, dude. Right. What a dumbass. How are you that unself-aware, right? That's just crazy. He probably just came back from like the shrimp cocktail, like hitting the appetizers before the reception even started. A little cocktail dude, sauce cocktail on his polo. Was over. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Still got a little sauce on his lip. Is this where the wedding is? With the hands! When your husband smashes the cake all over you before your first dance. Oh, hell no. On the hair, dude? No, no. Bro, no, I'm gonna say dead. right now, you're if dead. I f put smashed cake you're in your wedding hair, dead. you would have thrown the ring in my face on the spot. You did. All right, little on the lip, little on the nose, okay? Sure. Cute. You can fix, you can touch up the makeup. The you can't go wash your hair. The hair before the reception, you f idiot? Are you nuts? She's like, you know, she's boiling inside right now, but she has to keep she's it trying. together. Oh my God. Like cool pictures, dude. But no. It's fun. I get it. It's cute. I don't think we were like, no, let's not smash cake on each other. I know we that's We had cool, an agreement yeah, ahead of time. I have, no, I have no desire to be covered in cake right we... now. Even if I was like really one of those guys that insisted and I was like, oh no, I won't. I would have known not to do the wedding here. Like you don't spend hundreds of dollars and three hours in a chair that morning just to get cake <laughs> smashed in it after the 20 minute reception. Damn right. Or the 20 minute ceremony. And you do, don't you do pictures after the ceremony? It depends. Yeah, 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 some, yeah. some people no, do yeah. them after. Right after the ceremony. Yeah. Oh. So that would have been, yeah, that was the reception. So that would have been the kind of the beginning of the reception. Either way, or not cool. Whatever, yeah. It's like Mac Miller a little bit. What's the fail here? This is the most classic wedding entrance song. Like it. No, Dad. Oh my God, Grandpa. How do your pants just fall to the ground like that? I forgot his suspenders or something. What the hell? Yeah, but they went from like. How? <laughs> You know what? Old men have very interesting body types. What did he say? Oh. Even if I didn't have a belt, it would never fall that fast. But like when you're yeah, kind of you like when you have like a bulbous, you know, and then just a flat pancake, you know, yeah, sometimes yeah. that can happen. Yeah, a lot of guys don't really have bums. That's why suspenders exist, I guess, because your pants can just go from waist to knees in a split second. Don't not, worry about you. You got I'm plenty not that of quad old, juice yeah. and buns for days. That's right, baby. I got some meat on these babies, some meat on those hams. Imagine if his just flopped out. <laughs> He's just free balling it. Just an absolute mid thigh hammer. That would have made the video even funnier. Poor guy. He's probably a sweet old man. There's, there's no way somebody. No, stop. Come on. Are, how do you f that up so bad? Nice. Everyone appreciates a guy that can do a backflip. You're still kind of that guy if you do mm -hmm. it at a wedding. And then, yeah, that's what do you think's gonna happen? You're in a dance floor with dozens of people. At least it was just a, a wedding goer, not the bride. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh no. Oh my. <laughs> She's cooked. <laughs> All right, get back in line, sweetheart. She hit the rafters. She really oh wants, yeah, she really wants to be next in line for that wedding day. Yeah. Keep drinking like that, sweetheart, and it's gonna take a little bit longer than you might like. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Is he gonna smash her into a support beam? Oh God. Oh dear God. Jesus! Dude, drilled her into a door frame. 
Oh, <laughs> that's like a vertebrate fracture right there. Like that was hard. Do you think he like tripped into it or something? Did he, that was like full uh, speed. Full speed. He probably thought those were like hanging things that you could kind of blow through, but out of a door. That completely changes the outcome of your wedding day. <laughs> like she's hurt right there. She's gonna play it off, but she's gonna be all right. A little embarrassed. If you're like the yeah. dude and you're like responsible for hurting your wife accidentally on your wedding day, that's just very embarrassing. It's tough. Well, I'm happy to report we didn't have any fails as catastrophic as those on our wedding day. Nope. I hope the same for you in your life. Although if something does happen, remember, it's how you react to the situation and move forward. Can you make the best out of a situation or are you a child? Words of wisdom from Leon Lush. <laughs> yeah. Enjoy. Thank you so much for joining us. As always, we appreciate your time and we can't wait to see you in the next video. Peace.